with more than 2,500 startups and a similar number of speakers sharing 26 stages, this year's Rio Innovation Week is centered on the future of machine technology. The 2024 theme focuses on humanization in the age of artificial intelligence. According to Brazilian entrepreneur Fabio Queiroz, co-founder of the event, the question is how will people and societies adapt? We know that it's here to stay. Science is very important for developing our businesses, advancing our lives and protecting our planet. But we must not forget that humans are behind the machines. And sometimes they will be inside machines. This robotic exoskeleton can help people with mobility impairments walk hands-free. Artificial intelligence is imperative to design of this technology because it's built into the firmware and the software of the program so that when a patient walks, we customize the exoskeleton frame to their size, but it also has to evolve to their specific gait. From education to finance, manufacturing to healthcare, for better or worse, everyone here believes the world is on the verge of radical change. AI Pathology is a startup seeking investors to bring its skin cancer detection app to the public. The ability to quickly analyze simple cell phone photographs can save lives. We are trying to raise one and a half million dollars uh, to go to market in the next year. So what we are trying to do is to give uh, uh, some screening to the health public system in Brazil for free with a 94% of accuracy. There are no shortages of ideas and investor interest at this well-attended event, which aims to attract a global audience. Brazil, in particular, is flexing its tech muscles. According to the Global Innovation Index by the World Intellectual Property Organization, WIPO, Brazil climbed five spots in 2023 and now ranks 49th out of 132 countries, surpassing Chile as the South American regional leader. Lucrecia Franco, CGTN, Rio de Janeiro.